Hallelujah. Is it not amazing that we serve a living God? A God who moves even today, who speaks to us even today. You know, when we, when we connect to God, when we walk with Him, He begins to speak to us through His Word. And as we build our relationship with Him, His Word begins to become a rema, uh, dealing with every day-to-day -day situation, speaking into our spirits. You know, when we look into the gifts of the Holy Spirit, two of the gifts that we read there in 1 Corinthians chapter 12, we read in verse 8, it says, For to one is given through the Spirit the utterance of wisdom, and to another the utterance of knowledge, according to the same Spirit. You see, the Holy Spirit pours gifts upon us. He, uh, he, he anoints us, He equips us with gifts, and one of the gifts is the gift of wisdom, and then this, uh, another we see is the gift of knowledge. When we begin to go into the gift of knowledge, we begin to see how God reveals things around us. He reveals the hidden secrets. He, he reveals spiritual things. He reveals things why, why people are in the mess they are or why you are stuck in the, in the pit that you are. He just brings about a knowledge of your circumstance. Well, as the gift of wisdom is how to handle or deal with the knowledge that God gives you. So the gift of wisdom, the gift of knowledge go hand in hand. The gift of wisdom is how to act on the knowledge that you have practically. Well, as it all comes about or, or we begin to see it manifest in our lives when we begin to connect with God. In these dark times, it's so important to have God bring about revelation to us. It's so important to have this gift of knowledge, knowing what's happening and how to handle it. That's the gift of wisdom. I want to encourage you. The scripture says you have not because you ask not. You ask God, not just ask him. As you begin to ask him, that means pray. When you begin to seek him, study his word diligently. Get to know his ways. Get to know his heart. And then you will begin to see how he will begin to reveal things to you. And also begin to direct you on how you need to act on the revelation that he's given you. So once again, I want to say, for you who are connected to God, we are not living in dark times. We have the revelation, the light of God that constantly glows around us to lead us, to direct us and to prepare us for days ahead. God bless you.